and a little bit more oxygen in their breathing mix to help them get some of the nitrogen out of their blood before they go out spacewalking today. And uh, pretty soon we'll get their hygiene break done and then uh, we'll all go back into the airlock. Throw that over here. Lock back down. Actually, for now, I'm going to throw it right down here. Okay. All right, let me be sure Steve is good. You can see that the <laughs> he's putting his little partner out. I'll tap stow that, Steve. I got it. Paul's here working out on the mid deck, getting ready for a day. How's it feeling? Feeling good. This is nice. We get every day we get scheduled, uh, it's about 30 minutes to exercise. And the machine we have is a bike. We also have some straps we can use to work the arms out a little bit. And uh, it's nice. Work up a little sweat and feel like we got the muscles going because we don't use those too much up here. Good way to start the day. Yeah. Get ready. So the guys are all suited up. We have a little uh, leak problem with Steve's suit. It ended up uh, being traced to an O ring on one of the lithium hydroxide canisters we use to scrub the CO2. And, uh, our low ring had a bite taken out of it for whatever reason. And, was uh, making the whole suit leak. So we found that out. We were lucky to have a spare in the airlock here and uh, put that on. Sealed him up and he's good and tight. Right now uh, Nicole's going to check off all the tools and bags and make sure everything is exactly where it should be. Nick ain't happy, ain't nobody happy. She has all this in her head. And in her diagrams. This guy doesn't like his body. Uh, the bungees. Um, this is our bad O-ring. See, it's got a big uh, piece sheared off the top of it. The good news is it doesn't look like a fresh shear, so we don't think there's a little piece flying around in there. Okay. And I think the ground guys are happy that even if there was, it wouldn't mess us up. And I think I had the, the APFR is not really well. That is our smoking I, uh, gun for a leaky suit. Hopefully that'll get out of the way, too. Okay. All right, Alvin. Do good. Or, hey, at, or else. You hero. Here. Is this it? I, yeah. Uh, on the, no, no, on the top. Button. Okay, Alvin, you're on the flight day highlights. What do you think? What are you going to do after this CBA? Are you going to go to Disney World? Going straight to Disney World. All right, just checking. <laughs> yeah. You do good. Okay, he's going to be a proud boy. This way. There's the Steve. With an assortment of bags, getting ready to go out the door. Uh, that's good. Just like here's that. our hard-working team of Mike, a little bit farther there. Apollo, we may need a free and Nicole, this. who's always got a smile we'll on her face. Talk to us, Goose. I'm talking to you, baby. Okay, goose. here we go. You got it. You unfolded the towers. Last is coming out. Actually, there's a lot more steps to really freeing Robinot, but this is the beginning. Just to unstrap. This foam enclosure and start the process uh, of releasing our guy. All right, we're on the flight deck uh, watching EVA 2, and uh, Nicole is uh, working as the quarterback making it happen. How, where are we, and how are we doing? We're doing really well. They've been following instructions exceptionally well today as I boss them around. And uh, we we're moving are. really, yeah. <laughs> Moving really nicely through the tasks. Um, several of the things that we thought we might have issues with just because of the way the hardware is when we worked in the pool just went so smoothly here today. And um, Al's moving back to the airlock to plug into some oxygen for a little bit and uh, pick up another bag to move on to another task. And Steve is out still on the end of the arm um, finishing up some work that he was doing out on the SPDM. Oh, you're on. Come on now. Yeah, my job here, I'm just basically doing yeah, nothing other than taking credit for what I'm doing. So how are they doing that? Yeah. They're doing good. They're doing good. I might, if they continue Jack, this way, I might let them, might let them back okay. in the airlock uh, time. Awesome. You could take credit for their good work. <laughs> <laughs> I can see you guys. And we're taking uh, Robinot out of the uh, PMM and uh, relocating it to the lab where his permanent home will be. I think he's excited to be here, Eric. I think he's probably excited to, to get out of this box since he's been sitting there for four, <laughs> over four months waiting to get his chance. I think I hear a scratchy noise. It might be his Robonaut, might be his Robonaut fingernails scratching at the inside of his box. Alright, let's get it over.
Can you locate? Hey, uh, but before we bring him out of here, have you guys looked at the space that he's going into? There's something the in there, isn't there? Add up. Okay, I'll do that. My bad. Yeah. Control, control down. The left. Straighten him out a little bit. Okay. This is Robonaut being introduced to his new home aboard the space station. No way. He's very big. Hopefully he won't take over like Al. <laughs> Come on, get some in. Okay. Put your camera there, Nikki. Hey guys, slow down a bit. Yeah, come in a little bit more. Okay. A little bit more. Let's rotate it. Yeah, let's try to rotate it. Show me a rubber now. Why don't we go a little farther and then rotate Okay. Okay. Mm, it's backward. You got it backward. Is that right? It's backward. Upside down? You know, Robinus, you're not going to be happy if he knows you're doing that. Okay, you need to now, kind of, because now it looks like a big refrigerator. Well, it sort of does look like a big refrigerator. Tilt it back a little bit, a little bit more. Too, both Al and Steve did a super yeah, job today. Smelling it? The smell of space. Smell of space. Oh, Smells good. Cool. It's metallic oxide. Alright, there we go. Let's pull off the batteries. Uh, no, we're, okay, that's fine, that's fine. We're gonna put it back on, actually. You wanna put it back on? Yeah. Yeah, what I need is the temp stove these batteries. We can't. Oh, well, we sure you asked for 25? No, we, I asked for both, and then 
Here, give me one. All right, there you go. They look almost as fresh as they did at the beginning of the evening. Let's go. Daisies. Send them out there again. You ready to send send them out again? Yeah, We're just going to gonna swap out for some Metox no, and send you No, not as out. good as this morning. <laughs> you <laughs> doesn't smell <laughs> as bad as this morning? I don't improve. No, I don't. Here, if I clean up. They watch the whole EVA and saw your whole stellar performance. Who is that? Uh -huh. Huh? You want to say something? No. Okay. All right, the guys are really appreciative of the words. Thanks very much, and uh, we're just uh, real happy to shuck these oysters and get them some food. Okay. All right. Houston, take care of your plan. All right. So you want to get out first, or LTA off? If you want to try the LTA off. Sure. You, you want. take the LTA off. I don't care. It's right. your, your call. My LTA comes up pretty easy. Now here's the hardest part, yeah. is getting out of the suit afterwards. Oh, yes. He's easy. Are you still going to go to Disney World out, or are you going to do something different? Oh, I'm going to Disney World. All right. Let's check it. In your mind. In your mind. Look at that good thing. Not, not before you do a whole bunch more work on this mission, though, dude. Oh, yeah. We're about the halfway point right now, aren't we? Yeah, yeah it seems like. I don't, I'm not even sure.